I'm uh, Al Hickel, the uh, animation supervisor on all three of the Pirates of the Caribbean films at uh, Industrial Light and Magic. And I'm going to talk about um, some of the new animation challenges we had on Pirates 3. One of the challenges with designing the characters on both films and the Dutchman crew was coming up with a kind of internal logic for what these guys look like. Um, these guys weren't really given the opportunity to have uh, a lot of dialogue. They're played in uh, fast action scenes, but we do get to see them close up, and so a lot of the designs suggest a history to the characters that you might only glimpse a bit here and there or on the, you know, the third or fourth watching on the DVD. For instance, this character, there's a sort of half-digested, unfortunate fellow in the middle of this giant clam and, and his, that's fused to his body. Jelly, who's my favorite of the new guys, he has all these great stinging uh, tendrils that hang off him and the jelly wobbles when he moves and it's really terrific. And then there's Davy. As much as we don't want um, audience members to think about this while they're watching him, um, Davy's 100% computer generated. No part of him was actually filmed on set. We had Bill Nighy on set acting and everything we did built on top of Bill's fantastic performance, but everything you see on the screen is computer generated. In, in Pirates 2, we got to see uh, Davey play the organ with his tentacles, and um, that, was, that was really fun to see him using all his tentacles at once, and so we found a new way to, to do that on this film, a more gruesome way uh, at Mercer's uh, death scene here. <laughs> And, you know, this kind of interaction between a computer-generated character and his tentacles and a live actor on set is, is really difficult to do. It's challenging to make the two look like they're really in the same world and in contact with one another. And so that was a, a real challenge and a lot of fun. Another challenge we had on this film was transforming uh, Jack Sparrow into uh, a character a bit like Wyvern, who is the oldest member of the Flying Dutchman crew that we saw in Pirates 2. The reaction we were trying to get from the audience was to say, oh my god, look what they did to Johnny Depp, rather than saying, oh, look at the cool um, computer-generated creature. They just have the heart. <laughs> does seem to put immortality a bit out of reach. I love doing things like this where you just couldn't film this for real, and yet we're trying to make it as credible and compelling and real as, as possible as a human character.